Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to Subsistence Land. It is, look at this, look at this glorious morning. Look at the sun. Ooh, it's all kind of, uh, it, it's fall, the sky is orange, the, the moose are angry. Um, we've already experienced some angry moose, but what, what, oh, right, I'm making a bunch of cloth. Okay, uh, what is it we want to do? I, this, there was a discussion in the comments, and I kind of, I, I sort of agreed with it. And the theory is that perhaps uh, the claymore is just a little bit too far away from the base, which essentially what that does here, let's put this like right here, like that. Um, it, it triggers too soon. In fact, is that even too? No, I think that's good. They, they'll, they'll run up to here and they'll start shooting at the base. Okay. I think we can dig it. I think uh, we can dig it. We can dig that. <laughs> uh, but we are expecting revenge. Uh, we're, we're expecting revenge to come from over this direction. Where's the base? There's the, the fortress base and the, the hunter base is in here. It's always hard to find because there's it's sort of there's a it's very busy right in here on the map. And they're gonna come running right through here. There's rogues right there. We gotta we, we do I think we do have to take care of this rogue problem. And then um, and they'll come right through here. And then bump into the claymore. And I think what happened, uh, there was a, I had a revenge guy that came over that direction. And, oh, or it was a fisherman. But anyways, it, it was just too far away from the base and they hadn't really engaged in revenge yet. And, but I, but the claymore had attacked them. And so perhaps they had gone into their sort of angry mode before the, uh, oh, hey chicken, how you doing? Who's chicken? A chicken on the horizon. Um, angry mode before the, uh, before the revenge, and then, yeah, I don't know. I think that it's just a general, uh, generally a good idea. I'm going to bring the, uh, the claymores in closer. I think I'm going to do that from now on. Uh, I keep trying to maybe get them before they get to me, but I don't know. That may not be such a good idea. All right, so, what is the, what is the rest? Man, look at them. There's like a collection of bears. You know what? I think we need to fix that. I think we need to we need to uh, take care of the bear situation. Oh, this is actually kind of dicey. Uh, how are we gonna do this? How about if we start with bear number one, like that? And then what we can do is we can we can move on uh, to bear number two. Oh, fine. Use a shotgun. <laughs> there we go. We've created a little pile of bears. <laughs> oh, bears in the river go whoosh, 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 whoosh. <laughs> or something, I don't know. Actually, you know what? This might be... Oh, this is actually a good opportunity. Uh, I know we're expecting revenge. I don't know when it's going to happen. I don't want to sit around uh, waiting, just sitting here, just fiddling about and uh, all of that business. Oh, that's it. Just You can learn how to get through a door. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm just going to take... Oh. Oh. Oh! Moose! Mo oh, it's what's for dinner. Wow, today is turning out to be uh, quite the uh, nice day. Oh, we've got 16 of you. All right. Um, we've got, we've got uh, ribs for dinner. Um, we've got plants being watered. Uh, we have uh, bears being harvested for fat. I mean, how? And then we've got rogues right at the top of the hill that just need to be taken care of. Uh, that need to be taken care of like spoiled children. <laughs> Let's go get them. Let's go get those spoiled children. Are we going to get a, a revenge attack right in the middle of uh, going after rogues? I don't know. Oh, hey. Uh, they're basically over that way. But I do think we should probably... Oh, do I have shells? Yes, I do. Go. Oh, right inside the bear. <laughs> okay. <laughs> mm. Come on, bear fat. Oh, three. Nice. That's, uh, what is that, 19 that we have now? Oh, and then we've got Piggy Wiggy. I'm not going to go after Piggy Wiggy because um, I like the pigs and I don't really feel like going after them. Now, where is that, the robes? Oh, hey, let's get you. <gasps> you know what I didn't do? Oh, I can't believe. One of the reasons why I went after the bears is because I saw crates over there. And then I promptly forgot and didn't didn't get the crates. And now I feel kind of foolish. He's coming. 
Is that a... Oh, it's a pig. Okay, let's get back to the base. I think I see a, a, a hunter coming to, for revenge, so I think what we should do is uh, we should be ready for him. And we should definitely be ready for him. He was walking, which is interesting. I don't really know how they behave. We, let's see if we can... Yep, see, there he is. He's coming over. He's like, oh, I, I think I'm going to do something. I, I, I'm feeling really mad. He came over and he did bad things to the base, and I feel kind of... I'm, I'm, uh, it's, this, is, this is absolutely awful. I need to do something about this. He's all frustrated, and he's angry, and and uh, all of that sort of business, and, and you know, look at him, he's wor look at how sternly he's walking. What has he got in his hand? Has he got an axe? I think he wants to ask me a question. Oh no, it's a fishing rod! <gasps> he's come over to go fishing. Really? He went around my gr he went around the, the claymore, did you see that? He went around the claymore. <laughs> you crafty bark. It's gonna come right through here. Where is he? Wait a minute. Where'd he go? Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Poor guy! Oh, <laughs> let's get his bag. Uh, now, was that, I don't know what that, you know what it was? I think he came over here and, wow, he really got ejected, didn't he? Uh, I think he came, legit came down here to go fishing. That's not the revenge guy. I think he legit came down here to go fishing. I'm going to have some meat. There we go. And then couldn't get down to the water because my base is in the way. And then, uh, oh, there's the crate. I'm going to go get it before I forget. Uh, and then, uh, he couldn't get, so he turned around and he left, and when he left, he, uh, he had a, um, an experience. <laughs> he had an experience with my, uh, with my claymore. So, you know what? That, that claymore positioning was, I think it was spot on. <laughs> Not in the way we had hoped or expected, but, uh, I think it did work out pretty well. All right, so we want to go and... Well, actually, was that a rogue or... <gasps> I didn't check his... Oh, wait a minute. Is he wearing shoes? Oh, that's a rogue. Oh, that's not... Okay. The rogues are over here. So we're going to go that way. In fact, we can see the fire right there. Hang on. It's right here. Right there. Let's go. Let's go and... Uh, let's go and um, uh, deal with the rogues. While we are appropriately dressed with our red hands of justice... I think that's a good idea. Let's go. Do, 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 do. I wonder if the, it... Was there only one rogue in that? The, uh... There he is. He's like, hey, where'd Bill go? <laughs> I hate to break it to you, buddy. Bill's dead. <laughs> he went fishing. <laughs> woo, 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 woo. <laughs> oh, really? Ha! Mine's stronger than yours. <laughs> there we go. Got him. Got him. Where's his fire? There it is, right there. Uh, we are expecting. How's my health? Uh, it's not great. Oh, hey. I'll. Oh, I, I can't eat it. I. I'm, I'm already. Uh, I'm just gonna use a health kit. Okay, let's go. Let's get out of here. Uh, I have a lot of cloth on me, don't I? Thirty-two. Mm, not too much. Got scrap happening here. You know what? This has been a very rewarding little trip. Do 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 do. Fiber 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 fiber. <laughs> uh, differently colored. Oh, that's not that's not fiber. That's no. <laughs> that's uh. I could tell us. Don't worry. I I can tell the difference. This is fiber. Fiber 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 fiber. Man, you really you're you're not gonna stop bleeding, are you there, bud? Okay. Well, that's fine. That's fine. Let us go in. We've got uh, stuff to put away. We are still expecting a visitor. You know, oh, I should wash my hands. I should wash my hands. And I really do need to check on the animals and stuff like that. How is, how's your food going? You're, you're, you're in very good shape. Okay. Okay, we don't have to. Okay, you're still up in the wrong place. All right, that's fine. Uh, put that in there. Put that in there. Uh, we're up to 19 fat. One more and we can start doing... You know what? 
Actually, ooh, oh, you're doing okay too. Why don't we top you up? There we are. That's it. Okay, so, um, yeah, let me put, put some stuff away. House, uh, we have to, oh man, I think my shotgun needs a bit of help too. Maybe we could uh, repair that. There we go. Oh, it used up a bunch of the materials I had on me. Well, hmm. Uh, oh, we've overflowed on cloth again. That's good to see. Um, we can put you in there. You, not the nails, because you don't deserve whatever. Uh, that goes in there. Uh, I think. Eh, eh, let's go in here. Uh, bump, bump, bump. Nope. And that. Okay. And then. Nails, gears, medicinal. Four. Oh, I got another, uh, did you? I got another. You know, it's it's uh, the thing about the rogues that the, they deliver things like wood and and fire starter kits. They really are quite useful, aren't they? They're like my they're like uh, they're like uh, my support system. They uh, they help keep me going. <laughs> you know, <laughs> in their own way. All right, let's take a look. What's going on with you guys? You're not done yet, are you? No, you're close. You're close though. You need fertilizer. Okay. Uh, oh. Let's, let's take care of the plants. There is one thing I wouldn't mind doing. As part of the, uh... As part of the, uh, uh sort of, uh, monitoring and waiting for the, the hunters to show up. Let's get that taken care of. Uh, oh. Alright. I wanted to make another claymore. I, 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 it goes against my general rule of making claymores. Um, I tend to not do that um, because I just, I just use the claymores that I get out of loot. But I'll be honest with you, I'm kind of starting to enjoy them. <laughs> just a little too much. Um, was it two of these that I needed? Hang on. Uh, what am I doing? Wait, wait, no, 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 no. Not you. What am I doing? Uh, oh, it was two. An, an ingot and 30 of you. Okay, so 30 gunpowder. Uh, split in half. There we go. Something like this. And then we can go boop, boop. Actually, you know what? Just do that. And then ingot. One ingot. And then we can make ourselves a nice claymore. You know, it's interesting that making a claymore is... is relatively inexpensive. But making uh, electronics is uh, a horrible, horribly expensive proposition. <laughs> it says something about the balance of life and death on this game. Where is the value? Okay, here we go. And we we have a nice shiny new claymore. Do do do. Actually, yeah, let's not do that yet. Uh, close you. Okay. Now where are we gonna? Oh, hey. Where are we gonna put you? Where are we going to put... Now, I'm not going to face the Claymore. I had a thought of facing the Claymore that way. Then I'd be blowing up my own base. And that just seemed counterproductive. Let's pull you in a little closer. Maybe, like, right about... Actually, hang on. Coming in. And right here. And then basically right there. Right there. I think that's a good spot for it. Yeah, that'll work. That will work just fine. Okay, and the other thing I wanted to do today is I did want to try and make a trip out to uh, to the to Lion King and see if we can get some uh, obsidian. So I'm hoping that we can still do that. Uh, but first, uh, we repaired you. Do I want to repair you? No, you're you're. Uh, is it which level are you at? You're at level two, so not yet. No, we have to let that drop a little more before that's. That makes any efficiency. Th this is okay, though. These are this is cheap to repair. Um, what did I just? What did I have right here? Nothing. Interesting. I don't know. There was something I. Hmm. I'll have to review the footage. That that felt this felt something felt odd about that whole thing. Oh, we have a lockpick as well. All right. Um. Not you. We are going to repair you. Uh, the reason why I do these ones and not the bow is because the, the repair of these guys is relatively inexpensive. The bow is quite... is not cheap. It... it... the two... the... 
I mean, really, it's not that bad. It's, it is six scrap and two rope, right? And that six scrap and two rope is the same price for repair here as it is when I wear down to about, just about here, right? This, this little gap. So I'd rather not worry about that part. Let's uh, repair you though. And the helmet, because this is, this is what keeps us alive. In fact, I'm going to, I'm even going to do you. There we go. All right. Now, I think we should probably, should we head out and not worry about revenge? I mean, I, I just don't, should I make another claymore? How much, wait a minute, did, how much mass did that use? If we can, if we can, uh, we, oh, it's only 20 mass. Well, then in that particular case, how about we do this and then we go like this and then we come over here and we grab uh, half of you and then we go like this and then we make two more claymores like a, like, and just, just go, go little nutty on claymores. I think that's, I think that's a good plan. I like this plan. And then maybe we can leave the base. <gasps> yeah. Oh, I want to see if we can, I want to see if we can make this happen. Uh, if we can use the claymores to destroy the hunters before they actually, like, they're going to, they're going to, they're going to throw a hit at the base as they approach it. And then that'll trigger the revenge scenario. And then they're going to come closer, presumably. And, uh, and then maybe the, 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 these guys here will take them out. Right? Maybe? That'd be kind of cool. And then that'll keep the, the damage on my base to a minimum. I kind of like this idea. So maybe we could place the other one, like, right here. Here, let's stagger them. No! D dude, just relax, okay? This one's here. Let's stagger this one down to here. And then let's stagger this one down to here. Like that. Ah! Huh? Yeah. It's like a little welcoming party. It's like, hey, welcome to the base. Hope you enjoy yourself. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> I like it. All right, before we go, uh, because I do want to go and see if I can get some, uh, some obsidian. Uh, let's put you back. I think we need to look at maybe carrying a spare pickaxe with us. Uh, do I have a spare pickaxe? What did I know I do not? What? I thought I had a spare pickaxe kicking around. Maybe not. We'll make a new one. There we go. And what else? So spare pickaxe, food, water, probably fine. But we could maybe, we could just do this and uh, have a couple of those. There we go. All right, let's get out of here. Uh, daylight is burning. It's almost the end of the day. And I, that actually is not an insignificant trek to the, uh, the thing. And, and I think we will leave the base in the capable hands of uh, the claymores. And, uh, and, and then just call it a day. I ain't waiting around here forever for you. Uh, seriously. Uh, we don't have to worry about our little friends over here. Because uh, we did take care of them. I did get that pickaxe, yes. Okay. Hey, chicken. Oh. Nice. Scrap. I, I still hear the when you when when I uh, pick something up, it, you hear that it's the same sound as someone pulling out a, a, a gun. I still hear it, but uh, it seems to um, not be making me upset anymore. <laughs> it seems to not make me uh, think bad thoughts. All right, you know if we're gonna do this, why don't we? What is going on right there? What is that? Oh. No, that right there is a bear. You know what? Leave the bear alone. Let's just move. Probably bushes. Those are probably bushes. Um, yeah. Let's let's uh, let's poke around, see, and if we can get a little bit more uh, lithium as well. That lithium run that we had a couple of days ago was—I don't even know what the heck was going on. That was the most epic lithium run I've ever. Personally, well, I haven't had a lot of lithium runs, but uh, that one was pretty good. I was kind of happy about that. Hey, <gasps> will you? Would you like to provide me with my last little bit of fat? Oh, I knew you would. Yeah, because you know you're 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 just a, you're very giving. 
There we are. Oh, two. You just... Oh, you're a bit of an overachiever, are you? Okay. Uh, water right here. Wash your hands. Cool. Okay, let's keep going. Uh, we don't have a lot of time, so I'm going to be very cursory about this little... Like, that is not uh, lithium. And I, I saw something on that rock there, but I'm pretty sure it's not lithium either. Yeah, I, I, I think I, I'm pretty sure it wasn't lithium. But we could... Let's do the... Let's run the, the, the little bridge. And... Uh, if we can get, like, even just one or... Oh, hey, bear. Oh. <sighs> you know, we didn't have to do this. We didn't have to. You chose this uh, action, not me. I was going to run over the little bridge. Wow, that was a lot of fat. Um, and then you said, no, Mr. Ono Coho, you must stop and address me. Your disrespect at running just right past me will not stand. Yeah, that's iron. Uh... Okay. Alright, we've got another one. Where is it, though? Down below, maybe? <laughs> you know, okay, actually... No, we, we can't do this. We've got it. We've got... The, the purpose is obsidian. Not, um, not, uh, lithium. So we took a cursory look for the lithium. We didn't find it. That's fine. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. But we will continue on this path and see if we can find, uh, oh, we may end up running into rogues. Not rogues, sorry, cougars. We may have a cougar situation. The other thing is my hands are, uh, my hands are dirty. And, uh, that is a potential problem. I'm gonna have to probably use one of my water bottles to clean that up. Where are we exactly? We're pretty close, right? Yeah, we're there. We're on, we're on track. Yep, it's just over the rise here. Okay, good, 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 good. Just making sure. You just really have to keep the mountain on your left-hand side, and, uh, you'll get there. Ah? Uh, what? Ah! Uh? Oh, there's the cougar. Oh, there's the wolf. Do I want to deal with a cougar right now? Or do I... No, we don't have time, do we? Okay, we know where that cougar is. That's good. That's good. We can... We can use that to our advantage. And we can avoid the cougar. And then... Oh, there's some obsidian. This is what we're... This is why we're here, not the cougar. This is this. This is the objective. Okay, I can I can dig this. Get it? Dig? <laughs> I guess it's not technically digging; it's picking. Uh, wash hands. Have another piece of meat. Uh, keep an eye on the cougar, which is literally right there, and move along. And get up to. Oh, we are definitely running out of daylight. Okay, nothing, nothing, nothing. But uh, we should probably take a look up here. Okay, nope. No broken legs, no broken legs. Now, I have... We did get uh, a little bit of the uh, obsidian that we got. Yeah, it was, like, right around here, but it was it's copper this time. All right, let's go and take a look. And we're at bases under attack. Are we safe? I think we are. Let's see if we can see what's going on back at the base. Yep, yep, there's some gunfire. It looks like the claymores did not do their job. They're just they're just throwing themselves at the at the uh, at the base. They're although I'm not seeing I'm not seeing any more gunfire or oh there we go. There's one right there. There they are. They're firing. Yep, they're my base is being damaged. Okay, well the claymores did not do their job. <laughs> it's a bummer it's a bummer but you know and there's no and and the obsidian run is turning into a bust oh man 
Okay, how many shotgun shells? This is becoming a very shotgun shell uh, expensive trip. We're going to be running back in the night. Uh, oh. Okay, we've got half a charge of the uh, battery on the uh, on the shotgun, so... All right, but let's see if we can get some obsidian. None, none. Don't run off the edge of the cliff. Okay, well, the obsidian situation is not great. That is um, depressing. Okay. Oh, okay. We're going to go up because uh, we I, I don't really want to deal with a cougar in the middle of the night, so... <laughs> Late night encounters with cougars rarely ends well. If you know what I mean. Right? Because they, they try to kill you. Yeah. What did you think I was talking about? I know what I'm talking about. Do you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> hey, chicken! You know what I'm talking about! All right, let's keep moving. Uh, we do have to be... There is more cougars on this run, by the way. Uh, this is cougar territory. They like to hang out and uh, look for unsuspecting uh, young hunters like myself and, uh, you know, take advantage of them. Oh, there was something right there. Especially in the darkness, you know, because the, the cougar's strength lies in the night. They can see you better than you can see them. Uh, all right, let's just keep moving. I do want to wash my hands on the way back. And I think that we are getting close to where the... Am I? Or am I underestimating? Am I going completely the wrong... That's a cougar. Oh. That's a crate. Let's go up. <laughs> Avoiding the cougars. You didn't warn me, ch actually, the chicken was probably in on it. The chicken's like, oh, well, maybe I can pull that hunter over. And then the cougar, the cougar will, uh, you know, give me a reward. Something like that. Okay, there's some hunter bases down that way. And I think we're above the little lake now. Right? Oh, hey, look at you. Okay. Oh, man, I do have to keep an eye on the... That's a wolf. I do have to keep an eye on my, uh... Battery power. Is that the lake right down... This is the problem with the darkness is that you can't see... Yeah, that's the lake right there, isn't it? Okay, this is what I want. Not the bear that's guarding... The... Oh, man, are we... Should we just... Just run the, the, the thing to home and be done with it? Or should we try and wash our hands? Actually, no. You know what? I'll wash my hands in the, uh, in the, uh, stream. This works. I needed to avoid the guys up on the top of the hill anyways. Hey, wolf. <laughs> How's my stamina? Oh, it's good. We're, we're basically being powered by raw meat right now. It's most excellent. See? Not far. It's only a couple hundred meters to the... to our destination. Uh, you are now nearing Ono Land. Womp, 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 womp. <laughs> Is that the pig? Yep. <laughs> hey, piggy! It's been a busy night, buddy. Don't... And then there's the chicken trying to draw me over to that bear. That's... This is... Wait, wait, wait. Oh, yeah, we're going this way. This is predictable. This is the way it always is. Okay, I do want to go... Let's go around this way, because I... I do want to check out the situation with the, uh, with the base, maybe. Even though it's dark, we're not going to see much. Oh. You want a little bit of the old, uh... Do you? Okay. All right. All right, I see what's happening here. You know. I see what's happening. You thought you could get me in the in the dark. Oh wow, that was a. I almost have like a full stack of uh, uh, fat. Um, 
Okay, so let's see. What did we get as far as the claymores are concerned? Well, wait, 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 wait. Am I right? All of the claymores were, were, were done in. And I think it's a little... I think we, we diddled, diddled about, like, dawdled and all of that. A little too long um, to be able to get the hunter bags if any of them died. There's no hunter bags here, right? Because the, the claymores would have blown them out that way, but they would have damaged them right here. The, the, the hunter bags would be here. So did it just injure them and then, like, there's more than one, it injured them? Because that's three claymores. At least one of those hunters should have been finished. Should have been done for. With that many uh, claymores. I think. Okay. Got some light happening here. All right. We're home, guys! <laughs> At 70 some odd percent, they're just fine. Oh, I, I never did wash my hands. There. Problem averted. Crisis averted. Okay. So we can put that away in there. We got tons of raw meat. Um, we've got... Wow. We, we, uh, we've done really well with uh, biofuel today. The fat. We only got four obsidian, which is kind of sad. That's not... That's much less than that what we were aiming for. But, I mean... All right. To be honest with you... It, uh, it was, I, I kind of enjoy that run. It's, it's, I like it. It's, it's fun. And then doing it at night with the cougars, it's, I mean, come on. I mean, cougars are cool, right? Like, you know, they're dangerous as heck, but they're kind of cool. Okay. Uh, oh, that's raw obsidian. We need to cook it. There we go. We got a bit of the old, uh, lithium. So our lithium count is up to 30. Um, we've got, uh, just 10 obsidian. And essentially, that's going to give us 14, which is just... It's not a great amount. Um, I probably need to go back there and actually dedicate more time to that. Oh, I didn't put the liver away. I didn't dedicate as much time to that, to that as I should have. Right? So, that that's on me. I didn't check to see if I'd pulled out the last batch. I guess I didn't. That's good. Oh, wow. Okay, you're low. You are low. Uh, what is the power si- No, not you. What is the power situation? Actually, that's a good thing. We could do that. Oh, it's okay. So we, uh, what we could do is we could turn one on. And then that's good enough. There we go. Is it morning already? Holy moly. And those tomatoes look like they're done. All right, let's take a look. What is, what's going on? We got rogues down here, up, up, well, up here, up, up river. Uh, nothing else. Just these are hunter bases. I think what we're going to do is, oh, that's an interesting, there's like a reflection off that rock right there. So do you see that? Oh, rain, rain. <laughs> okay, I think what we need to do is we need to at least plan on doing another uh, fortress run. Uh, I, I do think that that needs to happen. So, yeah. Yeah, so maybe tomorrow what we can do is we could we could maybe clear out some of the these guys. We have to make sure that they don't do it. You know, the best way to prevent um, rogues and hunters from fishing illegally is to just make them not exist. That's, to me, that is a perfectly logical way to handle the problem a very natural solution. Oh. <laughs> they appear to be having a, a bit of a ruckus. There's something. Oh, there's two of them. They're fighting something. What are they fighting? I guess we're not going to... We, we can't tell because they're... I think... Um, what were they? they were over... Was it over here? Where was the, the boom boom? Not there, but maybe there. Yeah, we can't see. And whatever it was is done now. They may not even be alive. You get out of here. I know what you're doing. You're monitoring me. 
Okay, um, we're gonna do some, uh, we're gonna harvest these tomatoes, uh, but we are not going to uh, plant tomatoes in their place. Uh, we are going to plant cotton because I've got so much cotton seed backed up that it needs to be, uh, we need to do something. Uh, we've got 40 tomatoes. We've got uh, like a whole bunch of plant beds of tomatoes still coming. We have uh, eight tomato seeds, so we don't need to do anything about that. But what we can do is we can plant, because we have how much? We had 67, right? Yeah, we had 67 cotton seeds. Uh, and I think that we definitely should be, um, I've been kind of lax on my growing of cotton. So there we go. All right, now, and as I say, these guys are fine. Uh, what we could do maybe is just top them up a little bit. Uh, one, two, just so that we don't forget about them. There we go, a little bit for you, a little bit for you. Uh, no, 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 no. And bump, bump, and bump. And then that should, yeah, it's pretty close. 90 something, we're in good shape. All right, so, you know, I, I, I was a little disappointed, I am a little disappointed with that, with that obsidian hall. It was, it was not what I was hoping for, right? Look, we've got four l little lonely obsidians. Four of them. Maybe, maybe the fortress attack, if we go after the fortress, um, we'll actually be able to uh, get a half decent, maybe we can get some electronics out of them. Maybe. I, I, I think that we need to see more of the, the um, capacitors and the integrated circuits, semiconductors, whatever. Um, we need to see more of that in, and the uh, circuit boards in the loot from the hunter bases. I really do think that that needs to be a thing. If if that was the case, then we would get a bit more balance in the difficulty in getting electronics now. If we could get them in alternative ways, like, you know, I don't have to go and gather wood because I've got like 176 wood. I never chop trees. Why? Because I kill every rogue in sight and they supply all my needs. Okay? <laughs> so, uh, but we are going to need to make some grenade-tipped arrows. We're going to need to maybe make a some more Molotovs. Uh, I don't know if we're going to need the breaching charge yet, but we're going to take it with us when we go after the, the fortress. So yeah, I think it's a plan. In the next one, um, we're going to go after the... Uh, we're going to clear out some potential uh, miscreants from over there. We should probably take a look and see what kind of damage the base has received and um, prep for the fortress raid. And, the fortress, and then we're going to go after the fortress. And we're going to hope that we get some more electronics. That's that. I, I want that to happen. Thank you very much. And, and I gotta review this again. All three claymores are gone. That was a lot of claymores. Okay, I gotta. I gotta take a look. And they did a. They did not. They did a not insignificant amount of damage. Right, like that right there. That's, that's a thousand, that's 500 hit points. So they actually did a fair amount of damage and they, they and my goodness, let's get inside. There. And the, uh, here, let's do it the right way. There we go, a thousand. So we, we have to, we have to repair this. We've got to get this base sorted out, especially the glass. This is probably, yeah, this is damaged too. So, all right, in the next one, we're, well, that's the plan. <laughs> you get the idea. Thank you very much, everyone. Until next time, you all have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye.